Let's simplify the fraction 16 27 And here's how we do this. So what we're trying to do is find another fraction that's equivalent. It's equal to 16 divided by 27. It's just that we've simplified or reduced it down to lowest terms. To do that, we need to find a common factor, something that goes into 16 and 27 evenly. So a whole number that goes into both 16 and 27. The thing is though, the only whole number that's gonna go into both 16 and 27 is one. And if we divide 16 by one, we get 16. 27 divided by one is 27. And we're right back where we started. What that means is that the fraction 16 27 it's already simplified. We can't reduce or simplify this any further. So that's it. This is Dr. B simplifying the fraction 16 27 except it's already simplified. Thanks for watching.